Welcome to the IQ Personal Vision Tracker Vision Test Tutorial. Over the next several minutes, we'll show you how easy and fun it is to use your miniscope to start testing your vision and generating accurate vision records. While we try to make the experience as easy as possible, the IQ Vision Test is based on a number of scientific measurements. And giving your full attention to the steps and suggestions in this tutorial will lead to faster and better results. Let's get started. Before you launch the My IQ app, it's important to check that your smartphone's screen brightness is set to maximum and the audio controls are turned up to a comfortable listening level. Launch the My IQ app on your Android or iOS smartphone and log in to your account. At the bottom of the welcome screen, you'll see three tabs labeled Dashboard, Test, and Settings. The dashboard is where you'll find your testing progress and view eyeglass numbers along with advanced vision summary and vision tracking. Before completing your first test, your dashboard will be empty. If this is your first time taking the test, please review the tutorial video and take the practice test by tapping on Practice. It will walk you through each test step to get you familiarized with the actual test. The practice test is always available should you need to refresh your memory. Once you've completed the practice, click on Test. When taking the practice or actual test, you will be prompted to remove the miniscope from its case. Rotate the eyepiece clockwise several times. This will help you get a feel for the movement. You'll notice that the eyepiece clicks at each number as it reaches the dot above the IQ logo. Back on your smartphone, you'll see a rectangular white area with a dotted outline showing where to attach the miniscope. Carefully peel off the protective cover from the base and mount the miniscope to your smartphone screen within the outline. Make sure that the IQ logo is facing the bottom of your phone and the plus and minus buttons. Next, secure the miniscope to your phone by attaching the supplied elastic band. Now that the miniscope is securely attached to your phone, make sure the rotating eyepiece on the miniscope is set to position 1. Now, click on Test. This opens the test preparation screen where you'll be prompted to remove your glasses or contacts to ensure the accuracy of your test. A voice prompt will play with a reminder of some of these setup instructions. Make sure the rotating eyepiece on your miniscope is set to the initial position marked number one. Place your elbows on a flat surface, such as a table or desk, and hold your smartphone as steady as possible. Start with the miniscope at reading distance, which for most people is where you normally hold a book and slowly move it closer until the eye cup touches your right eye. Make sure you can clearly see the two vertical red and green lines through the miniscope. You may have to move the device around slightly to get comfortable with viewing them. This will take some practice, but it's an important part of getting accurate test results. Relax your left eye and keep it open during the test. Most people find it helpful to focus on a large object straight ahead at least six feet away such as a plant or picture. With the miniscope in position so that you can see the red and green lines, tap the plus or minus buttons at the bottom of the screen to move the two lines together until they completely overlap to form one yellow colored line. The minus button moves them closer and the plus farther apart. Pressing and holding down the plus or minus buttons, also known as long press, will move the lines faster it's important to make sure that the two lines completely overlap and create a single yellow line. If at any point you only see one red or one green line, try readjusting your position very slightly. Once you're satisfied that the test lines are accurately fully overlapped, click the Next button. Great! That's your first measurement. Rotate the eyepiece clockwise one click to position two. The miniscope has markings on the stem to verify you are in position 2. This means the number 2 is above the white dot, located above the IQ logo. You will still be able to see the red and green lines, but now at a slightly tilted angle. Overlap them completely until you see only one yellow colored line. Once you are satisfied that the lines are perfectly overlapped, Click the Next button to proceed to Measurement 3. After completing all nine right eye measurements, you will be prompted to switch to your left eye and to reset the miniscope back to position 1. Congratulations! You have finished testing your right eye. 
Continue taking the left eye measurements in the same way as you did for your right eye until all nine measurements have been taken. Congratulations! Now the test completion screen appears with the first indication of your vision. You can discard the test or click Save This Test. Now you'll return automatically to the dashboard where your initial test results and progress score will be displayed. After you take three tests with the Personal Vision Tracker, the My IQ app will generate an accurate set of eyeglass numbers that you can use to check your latest prescription or order new eyeglasses online. Thanks for viewing this video and choosing to be knowledgeable and proactive about your eyes with the IQ Personal Vision Tracker. If you have any additional questions or want to learn more about your eyes, please visit us at iq.com support.